from the Old Testament, there is many, many stories of people with great faith. For a woman, one stands out as a role model of faith in facing an overwhelming discouragement and disappointment. We find her story in 1 Samuel, if you have your Bibles out. And it is a testimony for women, for any women who feel disappointed in life are persecuted by the circumstances they can't control. <clears throat> and who is desperate yet faithful. Hannah was a woman who had a problem. She is a woman who went to God She's a woman who kept her vows, and she's a woman of praise. Woman of praise. That is something I want to be. That is something I think a lot of us strive for. When we get to heaven, we want to be known as a woman worthy of praise. I'm doing an ex-Jesus paper on it because I just... I want to know what that is. Um, have any of you heard of the story of Nancy Guthrie? She wrote a book. No? Well, in late 1998, the doctors diagnosed Nancy Guthrie's daughter, Hope, with Selwinger's syndrome. Selwinger's syndrome. A rare congenital disease which gives a child less than six months to live. After Hope died, her husband got a vasectomy so they would never have children again, so she wouldn't have to go through this. Great surprise happened. Less than just a year and a half later, she found out she was pregnant again. And there was like 25% chance that this child, her son, would have this syndrome again. But Gabriel was in that 25%. He died one day from six months. In trying to extract meaning for her suffering, she cried out to God, teasing out the themes of restoration and retribution and restoration and redemption amidst joy, Job. Job. Nancy, in her book, if you've ever read it, I, I strongly, strongly support that you do. She admits that that is how what she believes is not necessarily how she feels. I believe that. We should be women who, I find it very hard as a woman to believe even though I feel like I don't want to. She also says in her book that submitting to God and trusting in Him is not a one-time sacrifice, but a daily, daily submission and a daily choice. I do not want to sacrifice just once, just submit once, but I also want to know that submitting every day I will submit to him. 
She says some days are better than others. We all know some days are better than others. Hannah had a real and personal problem. If you got your Bibles out, verses 1 through 5 talk about how she could not have children. What chapter? Chapter 1 in 1 Samuel. God had closed her womb. Hannah desperately wanted a child. She had a rival. She had, because her husband had two wives, her and herself, her rival, I always want to call her Panini, but it's <laughs> Panea. Her rival would every day, even though her husband loved her, Panania always would rub it in her face that she had children and Hannah did not. This grieved her. So Hannah sought God. Like I said, Hannah took her, her problem to God. She took her sorrow, her anguish, her pain to God. She was very upset. She got your verses there, 9 through 13, if you want to look. She fervently prayed and wept openly to such a degree that the priest came up to her. He thought she, he wanted to shoo her out and stuff. He, she, he thought she was drunk or something. But she just desperately had bitterness and sorrow and wanted God to give her a child. When she was promised a son, a child, she went away in belief in God. She trusted him. And she vowed to give her son that he would give her to him. Like I said, Hannah was faithful to her vows. I don't know about you, but if I, I know many women who've had miscarriages, and if you tell them to give up their child they just had after having so many miscarriages, that was just an impossible thought. But Hannah, she prepared, she knew, she planned to give her child to God, and she did. She took him up to the temple presented God with her son but she praised God even though she gave up her son she worshipped him because Hannah was a woman of praise Hannah was a woman of praise God praised her in her joy. Hannah knew it was God who had given her her son. She knew it was him 